for the empty studio. This is how Eid Bulaga looked like today. Notice the empty seats behind hosts Vic Soto, Colleen Luna, and Joey De Leon. The longest running on time variety show in the country will have no live audience for now. Management says it's for everyone's safety, but even if we won't see shots of people clapping and cheering in the studio, the show must go on. Ibulaga says it will continue to entertain the viewers at home. And that's the news of tonight. Thanks for watching. I'm Maida Driguez. On Monday night, despite rising coronavirus cases in Metro Manila. In the Senate, the Government Corporations and Public Enterprises Committee will conduct a hearing on the stockpiling of face masks. Committee Chair Senator Richard Gordon will leave the session at 10 a.m. This follows the shortage in the supply of face masks in drugstores amid increasing demand due to the coronavirus outbreak. And lack financial appeal. Just last month, the flag carrier announced it had to lay off 300 employees because of revenue losses. On the other hand, senior management officials of Cebu Pacific opted to take pay cuts. But some passengers we spoke to in Naia have stopped their travel plans. They say they have taken proper measures to protect themselves from COVID-19. Hindi naman po, ma'am, kasi ano yun eh. Sa parang ano lang, lakasan lang ng loob. Our flight was very good. It was very easy and we had some um, domestic flights during our vacation. Everything good. To be honest, ano lang naman yan. Um, how to say, uh, lifestyle, personal lifestyle. Kung healthy ka, kung... Ano ka naman, ang tawag dito kung sa tingin mo naman, physically fit ka, at saka, to be honest, kaya lang naman nagkilalagay ng mask for precaution lang naman. Aviation officials hope local carriers will continue to help boost local tourism, but admit it will take some time before the public can regain confidence to travel as the world recovers from the COVID-19 outbreak. Chrissy Dematula, CNN Focus.